circuits okay now here they added one more okay and after that equal delay na here i'll he is uh, providing this input to all so all will take equal delay so in this way they have avoided that glitch problem okay so recall that we can include a redundant gate it include a consensus a consensus term in in the equation to eliminate the static hazard so we have eliminated the static hazard with the help of consensus theorem okay node c stays at 1 and therefore stay s stays at 0 so you will get the right output fine so uh, you read consensus theorem and then you will understand what is the uh, but how to uh, avoid static glitches essential hazard chance that a circuit goes to incorrect state uh, following a single input change because a state changes due to reaches some part of circuit before the input changes that part of the circuit chance that circuit goes to incorrect state okay your circuit may go to an incorrect state right because of some reason following a single input change because the state changes reaches some part of a circuit before the input changes reaches that to the circuit they are telling that because of this input change before you have seen that your circuit go to some other state right yeah. one state which you do not want so that only they are trying to say chances that circuit circuit go to incorrect state following the single input change because of that glitch one your circuit is going to one state and it's holding one value right yeah. so that only telling because a state due to input reaches some part of the circuit before the input changes to that part of the circuit okay so this is caused by timing skew so we have seen that timing skew because of that inverted delay we got that glitch so that is what that is skew okay that is a delay that they model so this is caused by the timing skew so one input path is significantly faster slower than the other okay that means uh, the arrival time of clock at a different in different blocks no, 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 no. that is clock skew okay they are talking about timing skew okay timing skew means uh, <laughs> you see previously okay what i explained here you will get output after 1 nanosecond here you will get a 2 nanosecond okay. so this is skew skew uh, of 1 nanosecond this, this is not clock this is signal uh, this type of skew timing skew timing. okay skew is a normal word so here it is coming up 2 nanosecond here is coming at 1 nanosecond what is skew 2 minus 1 1 nanosecond 1 nanosecond. nanosecond is a timing skew that okay 